You've no doubt heard of that famous French lick, Pluto water, named after the mythological Roman god of the underground. The Greeks called him Hades. Today, an invitation to go even deeper into that mythological world. All you have to do is look up here in the lobby of the French Lick Springs Hotel. Amidst the grand gold gilding are six magnificent murals, added in the 2005 renovation by artists from the Conrad Schmidt Studios. They tell the story of Pluto's mythological world. Although the underground realm is their home, this Pluto is quite different from the Pluto used to market the water. Six murals with an audience of cherubs tell the story of the seasons. When Pluto took Persephone to his underground kingdom to become his wife, Persephone's mother, Demeter, became very sad. Demeter was the goddess of harvest. An unhappy Demeter meant trouble. Crops that should look like this instead withered and died from Demeter's lack of attention. So Zeus stepped in and worked a deal with Pluto. Persephone would spend six months underground with Pluto, which explains the barren, cold winter and its shoulder seasons. Then she would spend six months above ground with her mother Demeter, accounting for the warmth and crops of late spring, summer, and early fall. The first mural near the front desk, called Spring, shows the mythological musician Orpheus serenading his wife. They would later have an encounter with Pluto. The five panels across the front of the lobby begin nearest the doors with Heron the Boatsman. In the afterlife, people pay Heron to be taken across the river Styx to the kingdom of Pluto in the underworld. Next, we see the man himself, Pluto, on his throne, about to offer judgment with Hermes, the messenger of the gods, assisting. Then comes the fearsome Cerberus, the three-headed dog, defender of the entrance to Pluto's underworld. He even scares the cherubs. The fifth mural shows the lovely Persephone, wife of Pluto, daughter of Zeus, and namesake of one of our former springs, sitting on her winter throne of ice. Persephone's mother Demeter, the aforementioned goddess of the harvest and fertility, is quite sad when her daughter is with Pluto in the underground. And so, in the last mural, we see people trying to cheer Demeter up, namely a musician and a storyteller. Funny thing about Demeter and that storyteller. Look closely at their faces. What do you see, Carl Cook? Uh, allegedly, those are the faces of my parents up there. The, the two people standing. Note the word allegedly in Carl's response. The tradition of working patrons or friends into works of art goes back centuries. Michelangelo did it in the Sistine Chapel, but the artist never publicly acknowledged doing it. And so it is with the artists from the Conrad Schmidt Studios. What did the real Bill and Gail Cook say when they saw the mural for the first time? A, a mixture of, of laughing and a bit of embarrassment, I would say. <laughs> and one of those cherubs? Well, it's allegedly based on one of Carl's baby pictures. Heaven only knows who else might be on that magnificent ceiling.